I nominated Tim for this award because of his dedication to youth work, for recognition for all the hard work that he's done over the years. The way he builds rapport with young people, inspires, empowers, educates, and how he is able to break down barriers for them. What makes Tim special is the fact that he's been not only ridiculously helpful as a leader, but also a, a pretty much a friend for the duration of the uh, DV Award. He's also just done an incredibly good job, and I do believe he should be recognised for that. Being nominated for this award, I was, I'm flattered, I am flattered. It's just my job and it's do what I do, working with young people, like building relationships, and I, I genuinely do get job satisfaction when working with young people and seeing them you know, reach their potential, whatever that is they want to do. The reason I put Rachel through for the nomination is because she's an amazing youth worker and she goes over and above in terms of her duties. She doesn't give up easily. She genuinely cares about the young people that she works with. I truly believe there's not a person out there that Rachel couldn't build a rapport with if she really tried, and that's what makes her unique. If she ever left my team, I'd be devastated. It's important to have someone like Rachel in the community. We've just been going out every week, doing activities with Rachel, starting us, really getting in trouble outside the shops and stuff. I feel really proud that I've been put forward and I've been shortlisted, and it shows that my work is, is, is valued and people can see that I am out there trying to make a change and supporting the young people that are hard to reach.